especially the people, mountaineers who are climbing on the mountain, you know, uh, they have altitude sickness. And to control that, they need to take some medication to resist the altitude sickness. Okay. And then once they reach at the top of the mountain, they would always find, they would open a bottle of champagne for a celebration, okay? And they would always find that the champagne was flat, okay? So, what's happening here? So, what happens, uh, we are always associating sparkling wine with bubbles, always with the visuals, and not focusing on the sensation that it brings on the palate, okay? So you have bubbles which are interacting with some of the nerves you have on the tongue and that creates a sort of tingling sensation and that's what is a pleasurable experience you have with sparkling wine. Shandong, Shandong as a mezzo is, uh, was established in 1959 at Argentina. Majority of grape varieties that we are using Chenin Blanc. We have a Pinot Noir that brings structure for, to give the aging potential to our brood. And the last variety, Shiraz, is what makes our uh, rosé with a uh, huge foot forward nose and having a structure on the palate. So, uh, my name is Amrutan, the winemaker and a brand of Shanto. Working with almost from the day one, making this beautiful product. And now, handling uh, currently the brand education. I'll just show you how to open a sparkling bottle. Like people will hear it from anywhere. You have to hold it like in a certain angle, temperature should be there. Then, this is called uh, wild music. Okay, This always has a 6 rotation, you can check any champagne, yeah. this always has a 6 rotation. Okay, It's ideal for it. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 5, five. and 6. Let's lose this little bit. It's always 6 anywhere don't in the world, okay? So you can have this nice storytelling element yeah, while having next sparkling. Sometimes it's popped. 6 bar is a not normal pressure. You can imagine how when the third target burst. Very very high. Then don't point it towards your side or someone else or someone you have. Don't like. Okay. So hold in a certain angle. Thumb should be there. Feel the cork is out. Then the next hand should be here mm -hmm. at the bottom. Then thumb and this finger you have to hold the cork, not the neck, and always twist the bottle. Never twist the cork. It will open. When it will need more effort. Always twist the bottle. Just this now noise is also more. You need a sigh sound. Very very less. So here we use three grape varieties uh, to make Shandong do. Okay. So the first one is Chardonnay, mm -hmm. which is 70% and 30% is the Chardonnay and Pinot Noir. Mm -hmm. In in Moy Fantasy, we are the only one who use Chardonnay to make sparkling. Okay. Mm -hmm. This is for Moy Fantasy. This is like a R&D project, but we are most successful and we got the gold medal for the blue also and for the rosé also in the main competitions. Okay. So. This will help you, the Chenin law, it's a very personal variety, as Social mentioned, the factors are important. So Chenin is giving good results in Indian climate conditions. Yeah. So you can make sparkling, you can make steel wine, you can make late harvest. So at different stages of harvesting, it uh, reflects different, different aromas and flavors. Okay? So, while doing testing, while you're drinking at home, anywhere, at friends place, when you're drinking any wine, there are a few things you need to keep in mind. Always. First is the temperature, must. Okay. Second, color. Okay. Color should be lighter. There are some aged wines which give you some darker golden tinge. Okay. But if the wine is brown, it's a nice oxidation. It's not stored properly at distributor place or it's not handled properly during the bottling at wine shops. They're keeping it directly to the sunlight. So there are a few factors which affect the wine. Okay. So like you eating apple at home, just keep it for 5 minutes, it starts browning, right? The same thing happens to the wine. Mm -hmm. So browning is kind of oxidation and it smells like a vinegar. So after 3-4 days, 5 days, you can't keep the bottle half open for a long time. Okay? Then in sparkling, I know these glasses are the right glasses to drink the sparkling wine, to absorb the bubbles. But always set the bubbles. Okay? What Kaushal mentioned during the process of secondary fermentation, Bubble impact is very, very important. So finer are the bubbles, the quality is always good. So you check the bubble size which is coming from the center. That's again uh, the part of the good quality is sparkling wine. Jose is made with 100% Shiraz, okay? And uh, Shiraz does very well in India. 
because of our hot climatic condition plus it is very disease resistant to common diseases or common fungal diseases we have because of the heavy monsoon and this wine uh, if you check out the color the color is uh, like a onion skin or a peach skin or salmon medium you know and then if uh, you check the bubble the bubble consistency is again when fine elegant and coming from one place and then you have a smell do we smell different than brut right it's more dominated by a red fruit profile you have dry red fruit sensation and if you leave a glass like 30 seconds for this now we don't have a time but if you leave it for 30 40 seconds you also starts to get some sweet spice sensation that comes from shiraz but that's that should not be the dominating characteristic the first note should be dry red fruit sensation and uh, then uh, you should have a sweet spice